really don't have too much time right now, so. Yeah. I'm gonna make it brief, you know. I'm glad that you came out on a short notice. I know you're so busy and everything, but I really needed to see you. Alright, well, first of all, before, you know, we get talking, I just gotta let you know. Um, why, why you didn't you tell me that on the phone? Why would you think I would come here? No. Why wouldn't you tell me that? No, listen, listen, listen. No, 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 no. That's ridiculous. After all we've been through, Chris, after all we've been through, this, you, you go and do this? You know, that's, that's the reason why I wasn't going to come. I wasn't going to come because... Look, I was gonna have to tell you eventually, but I didn't tell you on the phone because I wanted to show you in person. You treated me like I was not nothing, okay? That's what you did. You treat me like I was not nothing. Chris, you worked all the time. You was never around. I've always loved you. And then you go marry someone else. When the hell did you do that? This is like that soap opera stuff. You know, it's like, I'm, <laughs> what, what, what am I supposed to do? I'm sitting around in the house waiting on you. I'm babysitting the kids. Then what? You come prancing yourself in here late, smelling like liquor and smelling like all that kind of stuff. I was young. I was yeah, young. You could have waited for me. You could have been patient. I thought you loved me. On the other side, okay? First of all, you left me, okay? The school comes knocking on the. I had to clear my head. I had to think things through. Why couldn't you understand? I needed love. That's what I needed. I needed love. That wasn't the thing I needed. I needed security. You were just always gone. I can't. I can't do this. Okay, you were humiliated, right? <laughs> How do you think I felt sitting there 2 o'clock in the morning? The club is out, okay? The club is out. Especially a bootleg club you go to. You know what I'm saying? As a matter of fact, the club stayed up until 4 o'clock, so what? But you was at a strip club? That's when they get out 2 o'clock early and stuff, right? Whatever. You coming in there smelling like men cologne. You know what I'm saying? Did you like I was with my friends. Your friends. I have male friends. I can have male friends. Yeah. Smelling like other cologne. Then you're gonna try to play me and tell me. You're gonna tell me that's my cologne? I don't wear that little cheap little cologne, so you must have been dealing with some old cheap little nigga. Now, like I said, you left me four different times, okay? The first time, you left me with the kids. I had to go looking all around to your mother's house, asking where you was at. Then what? Yeah. So, the right person came along treated me how I wanted to be treated and every time when you coming in from the club I try to touch you I try to you know get some kind of romance you say not now not now hey I, I, I. things change people change how you said you loved me all I needed was a little time I went away and now I'm back and you already married so quickly what were you doing who gets married that quickly? And you try to play me and make me look like the bad one here. I didn't do this by myself. Listen. You can't, no, you can't blame me for everything. I still love you. I got deep feelings for you, okay? Look. What are you going to do about that? Do you love me? What, what, what is that going to do? What the hell is love going to do now? All I gotta do, all we gotta do, is just run. That's it. I, I know it sounds stupid. I know it don't make no sense. All we gotta do is just run. I have a plan when I came here, okay? I don't, I don't wanna see you cry, okay? I don't wanna see you cry, okay? Now, all we gotta do is run. I, I, I got a plan already. It's, you did just so many things to me that just crushed me and humiliated me. I didn't know what to do. 
I tell you I love you, you don't say it back. Who's on the phone? Who's with you? You say nothing. And then uh, automatically hang up the phone? What am I supposed to do? My heart is crushed. It's not working out. We meet, we argue, and come on. What? It's not working. Well, after I came all this way, Chris, I came all the way from Atlanta to try to work this out. And then I come and find out this, and then you're going to get an attitude and walk away like, I'm not supposed to be upset? I'm not supposed to be angry? Why did I even come here? Look, I messed up. I messed up. I know I messed up. But what, what am I supposed to do? Why did you get mad at so quickly? I was only gone for four months. That was four months too long. I sent emails, I sent everything to you. But you did not respond the way you're supposed to respond. So what am I supposed to do? You need a time, huh? You need a time, right? Hey, hey, you know what? Look it, look it, look, look. I, 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 listen, I, I know you messed up, okay? I know you messed up. But listen to me, okay? Look. There's some kind of way that we can be able to try to pull through this, all right? Okay? I mean... If we married someone else, there is no way we could pull through this. I, I can't forgive you. Could you come here? How do you keep walking away from me for? Chris, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? I have a plan that we're going to get it. Then it's all out. Everything is out in the open. Look, I'm sorry for raising my voice, okay? I guess this is us getting all of our anger and our madness off of our chest. That that goes to show that our feelings are still there for each other. You know? Our feelings is there. <laughs> hey, what's happening, y'all? Right now, y'all watching Sean Rock. What took you so long? I was just trying to clear my head, you know. Since we're going to try to see eye to eye about this Canada thing, just trying to clear my head. That's all just, you know. But um, I'm glad we picked this area. It was too loud where the subway was at. Yeah. We were like... raising our voice. We couldn't even hear each other, you know. I kept looking at us, but I didn't really care. So. I know, I know. I'm just happy that we got back together and we're seeing eye to eye and everything, you know. Best, only thing we got to do is go and get our passports. And from that point, we can shoot right on out there to Canada. And I'm telling you, I promise you, I will find a job that will suit the both of us. You better, because, you know, I don't want to. They're doing pretty good. Uh, you know, they're in school. I'm glad of that. They're, they're doing awesome. They're doing awesome. They get the A's and B's. I'm all glad about that. I am so glad. Your mama don't have a problem that she has to be, you know, taking care of them, being that. No, it's just, 
like every child, they get on the parents' nerves, and you got to deal with it. Yeah. I just hope they're not too disappointed. I wish that we could just talk about something else instead of the ring. Talk about something else instead of the ring. What? It's 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 a touchy subject for me, you know. <laughs> yeah, it ain't touchy for me that you're like wearing a ring that you made a commitment with someone else. Um, <laughs> It's not gonna be touchy for me. <laughs> See? So wait, I'm not supposed to talk about it. I'm not supposed to mention it at all. You can mention it, but if you can let me talk about it on my own, because it's a touchy subject for me. I, I, I made a mistake. I did something that I, I made a mistake for. And if we could just let me gradually talk about it on my own time, and, and everything will be all right. That's all. you was never gonna come back that's the reason why I did it I mean somebody come along they do and give to me what I was looking for you out of you give yourself time you know what I mean you didn't even give yourself time like see that's that that is the that. reason that is the reason why I didn't want to discuss this but my counselor Yes, I got a counselor because I've been going crazy. <laughs> yeah, I have a counselor that been telling black me. Black people don't go to counseling. Well, I, I, I can't. Counseling. I'm a black person that went to counseling because I was losing my mind, okay? And they told me if this is what you feel like doing, you need to sit down and talk to this young lady in person. And here I am. I mean, I know your emotions is disturbed, okay? But our feelings will get us past you. You know me. You know I'm not going to just up and just want to marry somebody like that at the last minute. So you gonna tell her like what are you, what are you planning on doing? I didn't think of that, yet. and that's the reason why I'm in my mind trying to clear my head. I'm, I'm, another thing, I'm happy you're here. I'm 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 I'm, I'm feeling jittery. I'm, I'm I'm happy. I don't know what, what to hug you or I, I don't know. You know, it's it's my deep down strong emotions that I had for you and still have. It done grown since I seen you, and I know it's doing the same for you. It's just. I just don't want to talk about the ring thing because the ring thing is going to get us arguing again. Well, we just cannot ignore it. Like it's not there. I'm seeing it. All I'm saying is at least take it off in my presence. That's all I'm saying. It took a little bit of time, okay, to kind of get you out of my head. Okay, I didn't really like put you all the way out my head. It just took a lot. I had to get you a little bit out my head so that way I could go on ahead and do the wedding. I thought you was long gone. I thought you was long gone. I looked online. I seen your information about you talking to these certain people and everything. So I said, hey, <laughs> she want to go and play uh, Mrs. Single. I said, okay, cool. And you know how I am. I can't be left alone. Okay, I can't be left alone. Maybe you need to talk to your counselor about that. I spoke to the counselor. And the counselor told me, okay, you listen to me. The counselor told me 
whatever suits me and makes me happy, I have to do it on my time. Because if I'm pushed and forced out of my time of boundary, what's going to happen is somebody's going to get hurt again. And I don't want to... Um, did you talk to the counselor before you went and married this um, female? I spoke to a couple of people, but they, they didn't really give me the stuff that I need. I mean, what was going on? I was sending you emails and I was talking to you. You didn't want to respond to any of those. I mean, well, I told you before, I need a time to clear my head because you weren't doing what you were supposed to do. Every, could you take me out? Could you spend time with me? Could you make me feel like a woman? You wasn't doing it. I, I couldn't reach you. You weren't getting it, but you have enough sense and courage to go marry someone else. You didn't try to give me that kind of commitment. I tried to give you that commitment. What are you talking about? Every time I mention it and try to say something to you about it, what happened? Oh, do you really want to talk about that right now? Do so you how you going to want to marry someone and you don't want to take me nowhere? You just want to work, work, work all the time. What the hell you do with your money? Okay, yeah, we have kids, granted, and bills. But it's like, if you're going to work all the time, the kids don't see you, I don't see you. What's the point? What is the point? The point is, we It's love. all about you. That was the point. That's the point. But the crazy thing is, I still want to be with you. And I appreciate that. And that's why we're here. But you want to mention so many times about the ring. I mean, come on, the ring is just a ring. It's there. It's sitting on my hand. Yes, it is, okay? It's a but ring attached to paper, attached to someone else, some other female. Who the hell is she anyway? I, 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 rather, I rather just don't really talk about that, okay? I just, I just don't want to... My, my, my business, my business out there like that. Your business, your business. So it's, it's still all about you, right? It's still all up in there. Okay. You know what? You can just take her to Canada. Okay. You know what? You want to hear it? You want to hear it? Okay. I tell you, it's Trisha from the church. <laughs> yeah, Trisha from the church. Right. Yes. Okay. She see, I'm going to church, I'm sitting there, I'm going through all my emotional problems. She's seen me do everything. She come and talk to me, and, and... You know, I ain't never liked that heifer in the first place. She was just waiting. Yeah, now she's a heifer. <laughs> now she's a heifer. What else is she? Like... Look it, look it, look, look. Let's let's keep this right here. I mean, I, I, let's just keep this right here. from the I mean, you could have go better. Oh my god. Cross that, Trisha. Listen, 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 listen. Could we just start this whole thing again and let's? You're gonna marry someone that could see my kids properly. Yeah, it's funny. It's funny. <laughs> yeah, it's a joke. Yeah, okay. She got a little eye problem, okay? Yeah, okay, but I'm looking how I she mean, focused on in the inside. <laughs> no, I'm laughing, but this is really not funny. Like, I should really bust her ass right now. Like, what did she get off? Who the hell she thinks she is? In three months? Listen. Wait, this probably was going on before. And y'all was just waiting for me to leave. You probably pushed me to go. All them times you was ignoring me. You see, I know, I know how you men work. None of y'all good. I should have listened to my mama. Yeah, yeah your mama <laughs> is one of the reasons why how we got to like how we is. You want to get to that, right? You want to start talking about mamas, right? No, get because to that. she saw right through she you. Ain't seen, she saw right she, through she you. She ain't seen nothing right through me. She thought she seen what she thought she seen was wrong, okay? When you see somebody under pressure and going through stuff and they look and they seeing stuff, okay? That's not real. Although it look real because, yeah, you traveling in the body with that and all they do is see that, okay? But I'm, you, I, I'm trying to, I, I wanted you to explain to your mother what I was going through. You didn't want to do that. Did you even talk to me? Did you even communicate to me anything? You just had me sitting there. Oh, oh, um, stay home mom with the kids all day. And it's just, that was it. I'm, I'm a person. I'm not a trophy. Did you just, oh, uh, stay right there and do nothing? I wanted to have 
dreams. I wanted to do things. I wanted to go places. I try to help you with your dreams. What it was you all do? about you. You didn't try to help me with my dreams. It was all about you. If it didn't coincide with you, you wasn't about it. Oh, I had to stay home with the kids. I had to stay home with the kids. So you know what? I was like, let you feel how it is to deal with the kids. So yeah, I went down south with my grandmother to clear my head because you apparently wasn't getting it. And I'm thinking you starting to get it by now and come back. And you done went and moved on. And then you're going to tell me some touchies. You know what? You got to have a YouTube channel up with your cross eyed wife. And I'm going to go get my kids. Can we start this thing all over again? Can we at least try? If we get over there, okay, and things is going well, we stay. Okay? And if everything don't work out well, you got my word. Okay, we split up. We don't be with each other. Okay? But at least give our heart a chance. Okay? Because our emotions is in it. Give our heart a chance. That's all we got to do. My feelings are so deep for you. I, I don't even know. I, I said, there. the school people coming for the kids? Come on. What I, I, I was worried. I was scared. I didn't know what to do. I'm taking the kids, putting the kids in the car, and I'm running around on the highway without washing and sleeping and brushing my teeth and everything, trying to hide the kids so the people won't take the kids. But you way down south in some warm weather with I don't know who that you was dealing with online. Fast butt. Yeah. Those are just my friends. Okay? You and them friends. Those are just my friends. You know what? If yeah. it was anything, why would I come back? Why would I come back here? I was fine. You came back because you knew there wasn't nothing. That's why. You know there wasn't nothing. Little cheap people. You know there wasn't nothing. Yeah, they cheap, but they pay me attention. Yeah, pay you attention. Yeah, because they don't know the other stuff about you that I know. 